Hi there. Today let's discuss code review tool in Power Apps. As we all wonder uh, whether there is any utility or tool available in Power Apps environment where we can actually review our codes, right? Uh, review our codes, I mean to say is how we can follow the best practices to make the performance better or uh, what uh, better code of conduct which, which, which we have used to uh, work the functionality in a better way or an easy way and uh, and how we could have given a best user experience to the clients right so today i'm going to walk through a very such similar tool where you can actually have a code review of your entire application and which helps you in, in improving your performance and which can actually suggest you which uh, what are the best practices which you have followed in your applications all right uh, let's have a review code review tool which I was talking about okay so as you can see I have created two reviews using my tool right that is the desk reservation reviewer is one of my power app application which I'm using and developed in canvas and also a plan a dashboard okay let's see one of the review uh, what it shows me right so as you can see in my screen uh, this is a code review for plan dashboard right so you can see my uh, score is 77 percent that means i do have some uh, uh, uh issues in my current power app application right issues i mean to say uh doesn't matter whether our uh, application is working fine but if i followed a better code of conduct i could have given my application with a better performance and uh, with a better user experience for the clients right and then my score turns to 100 percent over here okay so if you see uh, down below it will show us where and all we have gone wrong and which function could have given us a better user experience right as you can see uh, here it is suggesting for us to use a concurrent function right as we all know concurrent function is the function where we can run a set of functions all at the same time like parallelly uh, in uh, c sharp terms asynchronous call right uh, and you can see here it says app settings flags okay there are some settings which you can uh, we could have altered to make our uh, application perform better right same like that it points out everywhere okay we can if you want to have it a uh, bigger picture of view we can go to view details and we can find a description over here uh, and also the comments which uh, my tool has provided and uh, you can also go to the learning how you can use that particular functionality in your application right so it will also show you this red mark shows you that uh, this uh, uh, check has been failed that means uh, you could have uh, followed a better approach over here for your uh, current functionality okay so it does have many other features while you keep exploring you'll uh, get to know more about it and uh, yeah so going further now you all want to have this code review tool in your environment right so yeah for doing this please go to my description and uh, follow the link mentioned below and that link gives you a step-by-step -step process for you to have this particular code review tool in your environment and whenever it is imported you can always uh, select your uh, uh, tool for a new review when you click on a new uh, icon here it will pop up a message saying you give me a description uh, and uh, the name for that particular review what you're creating for and select your application from this uh, particular gallery below and say submit this will generate this will take them some time to load and generate you a review for you where you can review and uh, make your applications perform better well hope you guys have enjoyed this video and also have uh, planning to integrate this particular code review tool in your environment so yeah please go to my description and follow the steps and well thank you guys if you did like the video please subscribe to my channel thank you